Hey everybody, it's Rob Moffitt. Guys, really quick update. I made a video a couple days ago about a liver recipe and uh, I wasn't happy at all. It had an odd aftertaste. It, it tasted delicious at first, but it was not, it was a strange aftertaste. And I've been giving it to the dog and I felt bad about giving it to the dog because it looked really good. And, <laughs> and uh, I should be feel bad about giving the dog something that doesn't taste good, right? But, but no, I've been giving it to the dog and I had some today. I said, let me try this again. I had a pita bread. It's delicious. No aftertaste. So evidently there was something wrong with one of the pieces of meat. It must have been off. Nothing wrong with the recipe. Go ahead and try that. As long as your liver is in good condition, it's not falling apart or anything. You know, it just should be really tasty. I'm really enjoying it. It's delicious. Um, the second thing is, um, next cooking video, I think, have something I haven't seen anybody else do going to be making some salmon in a brown paper bag <laughs> in the microwave. Uh, I've made uh, chicken in a microwave before in a brown paper bag and it ended up tasting like uh, pork chops. <laughs> um, so I think you might like this video. Uh, it's kind of different. And another video on printers. I found a, I had a jam on my new laser printer and I couldn't figure out how to get the paper out. It was only sticking out like an eighth of an inch. And I found a really simple tool you can use. You've probably got it laying around to fix your paper jams on your laser printers. So that's what's up in the pipeline coming up next, guys. Hope you uh, been enjoying the videos and you all come back, watch more, and, uh, and see you out there.